I was fascinated by the women in Fela Kuti's Shrine nightclub in the 70s and 80s in Lagos, Nigeria. And that prompted me to look at women in toilets in nightclubs. And uh, I spliced that with the story of the Shimmy Club in Glasgow. The Shimmy Club was a club in Glasgow where in 2013 a story broke about a two-way mirror in the girls' toilets where male punters who paid for the privilege could watch the girls' toilets without the girls knowing. And within this location, I put a toilet attendant who is aware of the men and manipulates the behaviour of the women um, who use the toilet. That idea that she has power in one way because she makes people uncomfortable, in another way she's completely kind of exploited because she's paid very little, or if at all, by the club is an interesting dynamic for a character to have. I feel like toilet attendants are something that everyone has experienced if, if, if you go clubbing and yet I haven't really seen that character explored in theatre and, I, I, and so I was really fascinated by it. She's physically in Glasgow but circumstances are very much the same. She used to practice in the toilets of Fela Kuti of the Shrine um, and now she works in, in the toilets of Glasgow. It's got a bit of everything, yeah. doesn't it? Like yeah. it's got the story. Um, it's mm. got Fela Kuti, who people might not know about, like I didn't, or people who mm. have always loved him that will come and they'll pick up on those little things. Mm -hmm. um, you've got the dancing. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that's just, maybe. Yeah, that's what I want people to see: is the dancing and to. Yeah. I mean, I've had a few people walking in and out of rehearsals like, oh my gosh, I've seen us doing our dance and like, oh, I want to join you on stage. I thought the same sort of issues were in two such different locations and putting them together could bring out some really interesting parallels about the state of play, about feminism, about, um, about female empowerment or lack of it. As a global issue, not just as an African issue or a Western issue, it's a global issue. Audiences will come away conflicted, uh, maybe yeah. some empowered, yeah, conflicted, empowered, empowered like, sad, yeah. happy, like, oh my god, this is so great, energetic, I love the dancing, but this is happening, yeah. oh my god, what happened? It's like an array of, of, of emotions. Yeah, it's one that definitely keeps you thinking after you've seen the mm. show. Yeah. Mm -hmm.